Welcome to our virtual booth at the VR AR conference. We are very happy that you can take the time to attend our online session today. My name is Joseph Schneider. I'm the CEO of Schneider Digital in Germany and I'm happy to introduce you to our company and product portfolio today. For the past 25 years, our company has specialized in high-end PC graphic solutions. Today, we configure and manufacture high-end PC workstations. We also manufacture the scalable smart VR power wall working in 120Hz stereo with multiple phosphor laser projectors and a total resolution up to 50 megapixel per stereo image. We also integrate the latest fine pitch LED technology for our clients and combine any number of screen tiles into VR wall systems. These are working in full resolution stereo mode at 120Hz refresh rate together with active LCD glasses. What we want to introduce you today in more detail are the Pluraview stereoscopic monitors, which we manufacture since 2016. Before Planner decided to discontinue their stereoscopic monitors in 2015, we were one of their main resellers of dual screen systems. Back then, we decided to combine our experience with the planner systems and our engineering knowledge. Our new brand, the 3D Pluraview Monitor family, is much improved and we are selling these very successfully since 2016. I would like to introduce you to our 3D Pluraview desktop monitors during our session today. The Pluraview monitors work with the passive polarization principle, showing a full resolution right image on the top screen and the left image on the vertical screen without any flickering effects, even in a normal daylight office environment. In between the two monitors is a semi-transparent beam splitter mirror that reflects the polarized image from the upper screen and allows the other image from the vertical screen to pass through. A big advantage is that viewing the stereoscopic screen content is not restricted to a single person, which is the case without the stereoscopic displays. On the plural view, a group of viewers can always view stereo at the same time together. All that is required for stereo viewing are very lightweight and inexpensive passive polarization glasses, very much like regular sunglasses. The second big advantage is that passive quad buffer stereoscopic systems allow for the true workspace environment. This means individually sized stereo windows mixed with other monoscopic applications, not just a simple single stereo display in a full screen mode. Together with the professional Radeon Pro graphic cards from AMD and the NVIDIA Quattro cards, the Pluraview stereo monitors works plug and play with the latest Windows 10 and Linux operating systems and will continue to do so in the future. With the macOS operating systems, the 3D Pluraview works in a stereo side-by-side -side mode with all graphic card vendors. Maybe now it's time for my colleague, Stefan Oldenberger, to show you physically the main features of our Pluraview monitors. Stefan, please continue now. Thank you very much for the introduction, Josef. My name is Stefan Oldenberger. I'm responsible at Schneider Digital for the global sales and software partner network. I would like to show you physically the Pluraview monitor that uh, Josef has already spoken about. And I can introduce you here to the 28-inch VR Pluraview, which has a full 4K resolution for each of its two screens. And of course, um, we have the stereoscopic left image displayed here on the vertical screen and the stereoscopic right image displayed here on the upper 28-inch uh, screen at full resolution. Because of the passive stereo display principle, there is no switching, no flickering, 
both images are displayed permanently and there is no switching at 120 Hz or anything between the two images. In order to see the images in stereo, we have to view them simultaneously and that means we have to use the beam splitter mirror. And it's very easy to pull the beam splitter mirror out and lower it down to the stop here. It's very easy, it rests very safely up here and we can pull it out and let it down to the stop. And as I let it down, you can see that the upper image mirrors perfectly and matches the lower image. And this means both monitors are calibrated together perfectly fine, which is a prerequisite for stereo viewing, of course. At the moment, there is no stereo image, but we will see that a little bit later. Let me pull the monitor back up. Now, we have to have mechanical stability with the system, meaning that we have a very rigid, very solid CNC machined frame assembly. And um, we can put a lot of weight on this frame assembly and you see that it is very, very tough, very solid, a very good construction, which holds the upper monitor at all times and keeps it precisely calibrated. That is one of the major design criteria that uh, the system has to fulfill. It is also um, a very smooth surface. Uh, it is powder coated. Um, it is designed and constructed in a way that both monitors uh, can be replaced if necessary. If a monitor should fail, it's very easy to replace the, up, the upper or the lower monitor and uh, replace it um, with a, a replacement part, which uh, we, of course, uh, offer with a warranty of up to five years continuous warranty. So it is a very high quality um, passive stereo system that we can offer our customers. And this is the VR Pluraview monitor. In between the two screens, you will see here the infrared tracker, the dual infrared tracker. And they work, of course, together with the head tracking module on the glasses. And they work together also with the trackballs and also with tools such as this this laser scalpel or a, um, a manipulation tool. Let's have maybe uh, an overview uh, on the Pluraview monitor family together in the next step and I will continue with some slides. Let me take you through some PowerPoint slides showing the heritage, the continuation of development between the planar uh, 3D passive stereo monitors and the Pluraview stereo monitors. Planar started building uh, the passive stereo dual screen monitors back in 2005 and there are still quite some users today who are using these um, up to this day, although they become quite old now and they probably need to be replaced sooner or later. We have started building the 2000, in 2016 the 3D Plural views and are now having a full line of models from full HD resolution over 2.5K to 4K UHD resolution in 22, 24 inch and 27, 28 inch sizes. What is very important for uh, the VR AR conference is of course our uh, 3D Plural View uh, system together with the active PSD Pico tracker. It's an open system. It supports VRPN, D-Track, Track D and also supports native triple C plus SDKs. So um, any content that comes from the applications using these protocols uh, can be very easily interfaced uh, together with the 3D Plural View and handheld spheres, um, our uh, tracking pens, uh, but also with the head mounted, uh, uh, sorry, with the uh, glasses that uh, have the uh, tracking spheres on them. And um, it's a complete system that very intuitively allows you to uh, visualize 3D content and manipulate it in the VR environment. Very important is that uh, such a Pluraview monitor, VR monitor, can be used to prepare content for very large power walls 
literally in 100% compatibility. Uh, the content prepared on the uh, VR Plural View is the same exactly as it would later then be displayed on a high-end VR Powerball. Um, the good thing about the VR Plural Views with the dual uh, screen systems are that they are very bright and they are very suitable for just a normal office environment. And the content that you prepare also on the VR Plural View can be displayed, visualized on head-mounted devices and vice versa. You can check the compatibility between two systems um, and uh, basically make any adjustments where necessary. This is the complete lineage and we can equip, of course, also the other VR Plural Views uh, with the PSD Pico Tracker. So we can turn them into uh, VR models. Uh, however, at the moment, we um, are concentrating on the 28-inch uh, Plural View because it is uh, the biggest system in this that, that we are offering. It has the brightest display, it has a full 4K resolution, uh, but we can also mount the PST Pico Tracker on the 27 and also on the 24-inch uh, models, which are very good uh, machines, but a smaller size and uh, slightly less resolution. But in principle, all of the Plural Views are compatible uh, with the trackers and, we can turn, and can be turned into uh, VR plural views. We also offer not just the plural views but also uh, VR walls and also line polarized, very large monitors, which are geared towards use in conference rooms, uh, which are perfect for events and also trainings. Um, these can only visualize the uh, uh, content in the vertical direction at half the resolution because they are line by line polarized. This is the principal limitation of single screen line polarized monitors. But they are spectacular and they are excellent uh, for um, group viewing, for group uh, viewing with larger groups of people. Uh, the stereo impression is really good uh, from about one and a half to three meters away. Um, and um, it is very suitable for larger groups of people. Since 2009, Schneider Digital is also manufacturing uh, special equipment for large projection areas, uh, the laser uh, smart VR wall, which can work with up to 12 phosphorus laser projectors, which can display at 120 hertz um, to a screen size of up to 3 by 20 meters in size. Normally, uh, it would be a little bit smaller. Normally, we would have about six projectors projecting to a size of 3 by 6 or 3 by 8 meters. Um, still, uh, these systems can display up to 50 megapixel per stereo image, meaning that uh, the left image would be displayed with up to 50 megapixel per image, the right image at 50 megapixel, and both are switched between at 120 hertz, working together with active LCD shutter glasses. These are really high-end systems um, that are used in very large uh, installations um, in the automotive industry and in the, in the simulation uh, areas. Um, they are, of course, not uh, desktop um, anymore, but the VR Plural Views as a desktop uh, environment can prepare and simulate all the data that can later then be viewed on these uh, very large VR wall, laser, laser wall systems. Some of our uh, stereo partners, stereo software, um, we see a big trend in the industry to um, implement stereo vision, uh, as stereo vision is really a uh, instrumental capability of assessing and analyzing uh, very large data sets, very large models. A very good example for this is uh, 3D city models. Um, Esri, with its new ArcGIS Pro software, has excellent uh, visualization capability. So has Bentley with its context captures. And um, in between, there are, of course, a lot of these applications um, in the uh, medical field, uh, in the uh, computer-generated imaging field, in the VR simulation field, of course. 
that are fully compatible with our VR PluraViews and the other PluraView monitors. If you uh, want to know more about those applications, please check out www.pluraview.com and uh, move to the Application Areas tab. And there will be a downloadable list of these applications, which currently includes about 210 applications that we are aware of that are com fully compatible with the PluraView monitors. Of course, there's even more information under www.pluraview.com, vrwall.com, and under our main website, schneiderdigital.com. Also, you find information on the social media networks. Uh, please follow us there, and we would be happy to be in, con in touch with you and provide more information. Let us switch now to some real-life application examples that we've prepared on the 28-inch VR PluraView. Thank you for your attention today. For more questions, please visit us in our virtual booth. Here we can help you in one-by-one -one sessions and we'll be happy to meet you again.